Okay, so welcome back everybody. Super Sin with 713 here. Uh, going to be continuing onward today in Super Mario 3D Land. I'm using this recording setup, see how it works. Capture the whole screen right here. So that I can move it around, you know. Actually, let me fix this real quick. Don't mean to fool with it first thing, but there we go. So, Special World 5 now. We're making our way pretty far in this. Doing pretty good. So we're on to a ghost level. And it has flip switches, so that's interesting. Okay, so that's the first star coin. Hmm. It's good to have a more simple game like this every now and then. Pretty sweet. Yeah, I actually feel in the mood to do this right now. It's just simple and yeah. Because we've already got all three star coins. This is, I think we're going to be pretty good. Okay, got it. Wahoo! Yeah, this setup works pretty good. I was trying to find a setup that captured the whole screen without really any black space. And one that was pretty sturdy. I'm using one of the uh, stands that comes with the Wii U right now. Like, that's one of the main reasons I actually got it was for the stands, you know, for this recording. Other than for, obviously, the games and stuff on it. Like, really awesome stuff. As of right now, really looking forward to Mario Kart 8. I mean, normally I wouldn't talk about stuff that I'm looking forward to. But I figure I might as well. Although, if anybody watches this after it comes out, they're going to be like, man, that game's old. But, yeah. My main hope is that, uh, you know who can be in the game. Uh, but you, but you know who I mean, uh, Dry Bones. If anybody doesn't know here, as far as Mario goes, very big Dry Bones fan. If anybody actually watched my older CTGP Revolution playthrough, they've probably seen that I've played with Dry Bones every time. He wasn't in 7, which sucked, but he could be in 8, which I'm hoping for. Ugh, especially with the Dry Bowser Dunes course, or whatever it's called. Uh, doing pretty bad right now. So, okay. That wasn't too difficult. Uh, we're gonna take this thing out of our reserve, so. Ooh, he's coming back. You better run. Scary. <laughs> it's a danger. There we go. No, this isn't too bad at all. Course clear. I was recording some Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze earlier today and like, uh, it ticked me off a lot. That's all I can say. Uh, mm, you know what? Yeah, um, cut the video real quick. Okay, it's Nuki Tail. Why not? Okay, so there we go. Uh, 5 3 now. Special World 5 3. Keep forgetting to say that, I suppose. Okay, this isn't too dangerous looking yet. Okay, so back here should be our first star coin, yeah. Okay, so this part you kind of have to do that with unless you're as Luigi. Oh my, there's a, I forgot all about this. There's a little secret area down here. I was so about to say I'm dead there for a second. Okay, so that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. I thought I was dead there for a second. I was like, oh, there goes that run. Okay, so they're making this a little bit more dangerous, obviously, but 
overall it's not too bad. I mean we're just kinda, you know, just making our way through here. Not too much of a problem. Hey, that's something. There we go. Don't go to that box, it's just a poison mushroom. It's never really worth it to go out of the way to get a poison mushroom. Well, the game tricks you into thinking it might be actually something good though. So this is a pretty cool level as far as this level goes. The 1-4 type level goes. This is probably the best example yet. It's the most dynamic. Um, and no fitches. Okay. Hmm. So, okay, they give us a little red ring right here. Ooh, bad luck. Okay, that was just terrible right there. Okay, so let's see how this works out. Nailed it. Hmm. Dude, what I'm probably gonna do is just start cutting the video after every level that I lose my Tanookis. Just because. But first, let us go check over here to this mystery box, just in case they actually give us one. Ooh. There we go. Well, they didn't give us a Tanuki, but... Oh well. Then to jump out the way. Okay. Okay, so... Okay, Special World 5-4, oh great, back to Cookie Land here. Oh yeah, and this one side scrolls pretty quickly. Okay. Ooh, I didn't even see him there. He was camouflaged pretty well. Oh well. Lose it in Snooky and then gain a Snooky, I guess. Not really too much of a deal. So, this is a checkpoint. Okay. This part's the section that can get a little bit difficult just because you can't really jump through these. You gotta jump. Like, see that? You gotta really... Especially if you're not playing as Luigi, you gotta like get up some serious momentum on your jumps. Okay, so pretty good so far. For this part, there's bound to be some sort of trouble. Why not? Because there's a second one. Okay. So far, so good. Okay, there this thing is. So all three now. Okay. Just about done with that level. <laughs> I messed up this part pretty bad. Okay, there we go. Still time to get the golden flag. There we go. Okay, so we didn't even lose any Snookies on that one. That went pretty well. So, 116. It's no okay time. Okay, 5-5. Okay, this is sort of like a puzzle level, I guess you could say. Oh, great. So these guys can actually take out each other if they aim it right. Okay, we're going to go that one in a second, but first I want to see if there's anything else around here. No, there's not. You're always going to want to go by the one that has the coin next to it. So far, none of them. I was just making sure there was no, uh, you know... Star coins. Ooh, star bones. Awesomeness. Okay, so we're gonna go this way. Do we check over here though? I have the weirdest feeling that there's star coins. 
Probably because it's just the exact same room every time, but... Sort of checkpoint. Now this is actually where the, you know... Oh yeah, each Goomba is a star coin, I remember now. Yeah, this, this one has a very specific set of rules as far as how you get past each part and how you get star coins. So this is the next part. So far I haven't seen any other Goombas. There's one. So that's our second one. Only one left. Okay. So, and there he is. Now uh, this isn't too difficult. Now let's get that. Okay. So let me come over here. Okay, down with that level. Okay, so this one takes 180, we have 235, I think we finally unlocked another castle stage. Yep, it's time to go up against, uh, I believe, Dry Bowser, which is pretty awesome. Much better than regular Bowser. Oh, and it's uh, 30 seconds, I guess we kind of saw that coming. Uh, so, jump on him. And then, keep going. And this time, it's the time that's gotten from the Goombas and the Star Coins are just wherever. There's one wherever placed Star Coin. There's two Goombas. And there's no Thwomps. Hey, there's another stuck one. Let's get that while we can. And then go over here. Like so, and like so. And then go around here. Oh. Uh, is that Dry Bowser? Yes, it is. Hello. It's nice to see you again, Mr. Dry Bowser. And... We're gonna want to dodge that fire. That's a lot of Goombas. See how much time we have now. Okay, so he's being pretty dangerous. Hmm. Okay. That wasn't too much trouble. Done with that. So let's go ahead and get the golden flagpole here. Got a lot of time on the clock. Meow, 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 meow. Done with that. Knock that world out pretty quickly. So, uh, next time we will be moving on to Special World 6. Until then, please like and subscribe, and uh, stay fancy.